Hi, I'm Jessie Keith from Sun Girl Horticulture, and I'm here to talk about growing blueberries. And this year I decided um, I have a small urban uh, garden, pretty good sized yard, but not tons of space to grow fruit. And so I decided to plant blueberries, and that's what I'm going to talk about today, in large containers. And I planted five of them. This is a variety called Duke. It's a high bush blueberry and it bears tons and tons of fruit. So I want to talk a little bit about growing your own blueberries, the types to choose, and um, how to grow them in containers or in the ground so you have your own blueberries at home to enjoy. And the great thing about these guys is that when I bought them, and I just planted them this year, they were covered with flowers. So they're, they're going to have tons and tons of fruit. I'm very excited. So let's talk blueberries. Just a few facts about blueberries. They're shrubs, short or tall with hundreds of different varieties. Bee pollinated, acid soil lovers, related to cranberries and azaleas, and high in antioxidants. Here's more about blueberries, their varieties, and how to grow them. Blueberries develop little bell-shaped flowers in spring, which bees pollinate. The summer berries are produced in early, mid-season or late season, depending on the variety. Blueberries are ideal for edible landscaping. They grow well in ground or in containers. They're bushy, attractive, and their leaves turn brilliant shades of orange, purple, and red in fall. Before adding them to your yard or garden, it's good to know what types are available. Lowbush blueberries reach between one and two feet high and bear small, very flavorful fruits in midsummer. They're found in fields and dappled forests across northeastern North America, where they create carpets of wild berries. Grow them in sunny or partially shaded gardens. Northern highbush blueberries are most popular with home gardeners because they're hardy, produce lots of big berries, and have brilliant fall color. The variety Blue Ray has extra large fruits early to mid-season. Duke is high yielding with upright shrubs and Elliot is a good late producer. Heat and drought tolerance makes rabbit eyes desirable for the deep south. The tall bushy plants have nice spring flowers, clusters of fruit and orange red fall color. Try Tiff Blue, which has large berries mid-season or Brightwell, which produces large clusters early to mid-season. These vigorous hybrids are crosses of several southern species and were initially bred for California fruit production, but they also grow well in the south and southwest. They are tall, heavy fruiting, and adaptable. Try the vigorous large-fruited Cape Fear, Robust Sharp Blue, and Upright Legacy, which has very large tasty fruits. Many designer blueberries have been bred to be beautiful, fruitful, and the perfect shape and size for containers and landscapes. The bushel and berry has produced the best, such as the boxwood-like blueberry glaze and cute round jelly bean. Both have delicious fruit, tidy habits, and bright fall color. So as I said, when I planted these blueberries, they were covered with flowers. And you can see now they've got loads and loads of berries. And when I planted them, I amended the soil with black gold garden compost blend. I fed uh, the plants with a, a, fertil a fertilizer for acid loving plants, such as blueberries. And then also as a mulch and something to cool the soil, I added white pine needles, which as they break down are acidifying. And all of these things will do wonders to help these berries grow. I also keep them well irrigated so they continue to look great and grow well all season long. Plant your berries in full to partial sun. Partial sun is better in zones with scorching hot summers. Plant blueberries in spring or fall. They like well-drained, sandy or loamy soils with an acid pH between 4.5 and 
If the soil pH is higher, blueberries can't access necessary nutrients and their leaves start to turn yellow. Amending the soil with black gold Canadian sphagnum peat moss and feeding with an acid fertilizer helps. Potted blueberries grow best in black gold natural and organic potting mix amended with additional black gold perlite or sand for added drainage. Use pine needles or dry moss as a surface mulch. Blueberries like moderate moisture but not wet feet, so don't overwater them. Average rain and irrigation will suffice. Birds and other animals also love blueberries, so protect the plants with netting as their fruits mature. Blueberries can get a number of stem cankers, leaf spot diseases, pests, and other problems. If you experience an issue that you can't solve on your own, ask your local extension agent or visit our Ask a Garden Expert free support service for answers. Harvest your berries when they're plump and juicy for fresh eating, preserves, pancakes, or pies. Try blueberries this season in containers if you want to give them a try. You'll likely get hooked and want more. Happy blueberry growing!